वेलकम एवरी वन एंड लेट स्टार्ट द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक विच इज द एंथालपी ऑफ रिएक्शन और यू मे ऑल्सो कार्ड इज इट द स्टैंडर्ड एंथालपी ऑफ द रिएक्शन हेयर द सिंबल डेल्टा शोज चेंज एच इज फॉर एंथालपी एंड दिस नॉट डेट शोज द स्टैंडर्ड मेन वी आर वर्किंग अंडर द स्टैंडर्ड कंडीशन वट इज द डिफिनेशन ऑफ एंथालपी रिएक्शन अमाउंट ऑफ हीट रिलीज और एब्सॉर्ब इन सम केसेज द हीट इज रिलीज डेट आर एक्सोथर्मिक केसेज एंड इन द अदर द हीट इज एब्सॉर्ब डेट आर द एंडोथर्मिक केसेज वेन स्टैक्योमेट्रिक अमाउंट ऑफ रिएक्टेंट्स नो वट इज मेड बाय द स्टैक्योमेट्रिक अमाउंट्स स्टैक्योमेट्रिक अमाउंट्स आर बेसिकली दोज अमाउंट्स डेट आर शोन और डेट आर प्रेजेंट इन द बैलेंसड केमिकल इक्वेशन of reactants react to form stoichiometric amount of the products so stoichiometric amount of the reactants and products that must be mentioned by that thermochemical equation under standard conditions of temperature and pressure now in this definition there are two parts which are very important one is the stoichiometric amount and second is the standard conditions of temperature and pressure and standard conditions are 25 degree c or 298 kelvin 1 atm pressure and all the reactants and products they must be present in their standard physical states you know the first example of the enthalpy of the reaction is the enthalpy of formation the enthalpy of formation is shown with the symbol delta h not f where f is for formation it might be positive or negative but always keep in your mind that in most of the cases the enthalpy of formation is negative and all those compounds for which the enthalpy of formation is negative they are usually stable and those for which the enthalpy of formation is positive they are unstable now when we call the enthalpy of reaction specifically the enthalpy of formation it is the case when the elements they react to form one mole of the compound mean the condition is that the reactants must be the elements and the compound must be and the product must be a compound but its quantity is one mole if the elements do not react to form compound this cannot be called as the enthalpy of formation and if the compound is formed but two moles are less than one mole half mole is formed then even in that case the enthalpy cannot be called as the standard enthalpy of formation for example magnesium reacts with oxygen to form magnesium oxide in this case the enthalpy of formation is minus 692 kilojoule per mole mean it is exothermic while when n2 reacts with o2 to form no in this case the enthalpy of formation is positive it simply means that magnesium oxide is a stable compound because its enthalpy of formation is negative while n no nitric oxide that is unstable because its enthalpy of formation is positive now if there are four compounds and their enthalpy of formation are given and the required is that which of the following is most stable one then that compound will be most stable in which maximum energy will be released for an example i will tell you that there is a compound a b and c its enthalpy of formation is minus 200 its enthalpy of formation is 200 its enthalpy of formation is 100 so which of the following will be maximum stable in this case the a will be showing maximum stability why a is maximum stable because in the formation of a the maximum energy is released so a compound will be at the least energy level so it will be showing the maximum stability the enthalpy of formation is zero when the elements are present in their standard form so in order to make it clear let me give you an example that we have four options bromine solid bromine liquid bromine gas and delta option is all of this so for which of the following the standard enthalpy of formation is zero the standard enthalpy of formation is zero only if the element is present in its standard form and you know the standard form of the bromine is liquid 
so for bigger two liquid the enthalpy of formation would be zero now it is not necessary that all the allotropes of an element their standard enthalpy of formation will be zero just like ozone o3 the enthalpy of formation of ozone is 142.7 kilojoule per mole it is not equal to zero even it is allotropic form of the oxygen but because ozone is highly unstable and when the ozone is formed as a result of a photochemical reaction there is a dynamic equilibrium between the molecular oxygen at ozone and the energy is absorbed in the form of the radiation so 142.7 is the kilojoule per mole is the enthalpy of formation of the ozone